A question I keep getting asked often by, by folks is, why do general contractors like myself charge so much money? And I, I look at these kinds of questions and I'm like, are you kidding? You, you are kidding, right? You're asking me why I charge so much money for a house renovation? Please, the real question should be, am I actually charging you enough to take on your little project? A man of my, my stature deserves a lot of money for, for their efforts. You see my little whippersnapper, using the services of a, a bona fide general contractor like myself, it requires, a, it requires a hefty price. On a house renovation that's in that $50,000 price range, I would have a, it'd probably be somewhere around the fifteen dollars to $20,000 profit margin built into that, to that renovation. Now, if there's a house renovation that's up in that $100,000 price range, I make sure that I make somewhere around about eh, twenty-five dollars to $30,000 in profit for my work. Now, you might say that this is outrageous. How could you charge $30,000 for three or four months worth of work on a project where all you have to do is just supply the management and supervision of the project? So, but folks, let me explain why I, general contractors have to charge this kind of money. There are, costs being, there are costs involved in being a general contractor. There's your license and possible training that it requires, depending on the municipality and area that you operate in. There's liability, insurance, and there's other stuff like marketing, bookkeeping, and stuff like that. What about the, the possible equipment, the tools, the, and the staff that I, that I bring to your project as well? What about my vacations in Fiji? The speedboats, the, the sports cars, and all the accoutrements that come with being a general contractor. Someone has to pay for all these things, and uh, I'm afraid that person is, is you. Seriously speaking, $30,000 profit divided over three or four months of, a, of supervision is, so it works out being, being around $10,000 a month. Is that a lot of money for someone who takes on the responsibility and liability of a renovation project? I'll let you decide. People need to consider that the life of a contractor, well, it's not easy. Yeah, depending on where you live, weather plays a major part in how much money you can make as a contractor in renovation and construction. Construction slows down dramatically in the winter, no matter where you live. The holidays during December is a time where most people just want to spend time with their, with their families and not deal with contractors and, and their work. In the summertime, business is, is booming. And there's a lot of work out there, but you, you can't bank it to, to use for later on. And, and you tell your customers to, you can't tell your customers to wait around until November to you know, get around to that project of theirs. As a contractor, you take on as much as you can and make excuses for being late or to start or to finish a project. There's a limited amount of work that you can take on. And as a result, you will always lose business to someone else. There have been many times where I've taken work that I had low margins because I wanted to keep my employees working. And as soon as I signed that contract and took on this junky project, a juicy project came around, another one came around that, uh, that, would have had to, that I had to pass on because I was, I was busy. Construction renovation business is pretty tough. And it's, never, it's never steady. You are constantly on the hunt for more work and when you find it, you, you need to capitalize on it. And that's the breakdown of the business of a contractor and why they charge as much as they do. If you think, you, if you think that you can plan and manage your own renovation, then you're definitely on the right path. There is a considerable amount of money that you can save. The biggest issue is that you will encounter is finding the right information resources to, to help you out on your journey. Once you're able to figure it out, house renovations uh, will be a skill set that you can use for the you know, rest of your life throughout your real estate investment career. It will help you in determining renovation costs for future property acquisitions and you'll save money by completing the house renovation yourself. For more information on house renovations, rehabbing, and, and you know, real estate investing, visit www.vansturgeon.com to, to help you in your real estate investment journey. Thank you.